Hello, this is Jam Master Daniel 96 and in today's video, I'll be going over some news about a Boba Fett series possibly being in development for Disney Plus, so let's begin. This comes from fandomwire.com. Now at the end of the video, I'll link the article down below for you to check out and this article is titled Boba Fett Project in Development for Disney Plus. So let's begin. Star Wars fans are rejoicing at the report of bounty hunter Boba Fett making his triumphant return in Season 2 of Disney Plus' The Mandalorian, but there is more to this story than has been previously reported. We can exclusively confirm that even more Boba Fett is in the works. In fact, we have a massive update on an entire slate of Disney Plus Star Wars series and films currently in development at Lucasfilm. That will be released in all weeks, so be sure to check back and follow, I mean, you know, check their Facebook page. And um, let's continue on. For all these reports, it's important to stress that in development means teams connected to Lucasfilm are prepping and writing the following projects. It does not guarantee they will all make it to air, but these are current projects that we've been told are actively in the works behind the scenes. And it says, Boba Fett Disney Plus Project. While we knew of Jango Fett actor Tamara Morrison's return, we still trying to confirm whether he was indeed playing Boba Fett or Captain Rex from Clone Wars since our sources have heard both characters will appear in The Mandalorian at some point. However, what we know for sure is that a solo Boba Fett project is very much in development for Disney Plus as either a show or a movie. Disney Plus is keen on not just making Star Wars limited series, but also Star Wars features. It's unclear which format they are finalizing for Boba Fett, but Kathleen Kennedy still believes fans want more Boba Fett, so they are working on more behind the scenes. Fans may recall Filmmaker Josh Trank working on a Boba Fett feature in 2015 before leaving due to the failure of Fantastic Four. A new piece from Polygon chronicling the Chronicle director reveals that Trank in fact quit the project before Disney could fire him from the drama surrounding his Fantastic Four. The full article is a fascinating read that finally offers Trank's side of things and Here's the thing I'll read to you, and then I'll give you my thoughts at the end on the whole Boba Fett project. Here's the thing about Josh Trank. At the time, Trank rented a house in Benedict Canyon just a few blocks from where George Lucas lived with his editor and wife, Marsha Lucas, when he wrote the first draft of Star Wars. Within, with a few days to meal over, Kinberg's offer, Trank walked up to the Lucas house and basked in its glow. He called it one of the most surreal moments of his life. The vision that I had in that moment were just out of this world. He said we he walked to his home with a three act pitch for a Boba Fett movie. And that's a pretty interesting thing right there. So let's continue on. Not only does Lucasfilm have Trank's three-act pitch for his Boba Fett movie lying around that was clearly shelved due to the director's performance rather than his solid creative pitch, they also have the creative details from James Mangold's announced then-canceled Boba Fett movie. With all these takes on the character, it's no surprise that a Boba Fett project is still at, in active development waiting for the right time to pop out of that Sarlacc pit. Then, you know, they talk about how... And then there's the thing from Hollywood Reporter. It has also reported what we heard rumbling. And then it said Boba actually already cameoed in The Mandalorian Season 1 as the one who saved Ming-Na's character in Episode 5, The Gunslinger. So that's probably a good possibility that I'm saying it is getting warmer. It's him. So here we go. So a lot of stuff in this article. The Mandalorian feels like the right time and place for Boba Fett to finally make another live action appearance. And if fans embrace him again, Lucasfilm will now be ready to fast track the project to either a series or a film. 
We'll just have to wait and see how everything plays out. And then it says that, you know, we have they have more on the projects to reveal. So, you know, check on their Facebook page and stuff. And that is pretty much the article. And I'll link it down below for you to check out. And it is interesting that a Boba Fett series is being considered. And then they do talk. I do vaguely remember about Josh Trank's Boba Fett movie. And then it got canceled. So I definitely vaguely remember that. And so with him appearing. And I did, you know, cover the Mandalorian news. That he could be appearing. And I did say, you know, in my review of that episode. When I was reviewing the season one. And um, covering the news that I did think at the end of that episode. It is him, and it is a good possibility. And then, so I mean, there are there are probably are planning to do big things with Boba Fett in the future. And that's pretty much all I gotta say. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe to the channel, comment what you think down below. Do you want to see a Boba Fett project for Disney Plus? And don't forget to share this video to spread the word about the channel. So I'll catch you guys next time with another video.